Hi everyone and happy Valentine's Day. So for those of you who don't know me, my name is Philip and if you listen to the video you already know what this is about uh, because today I am, well tonight, <laughs> I am going to make a Valentine's Day present for my girlfriend. In case you're new here, my girlfriend's name is Stephanie Jarvis of the Chateau de la Lande. We've been together for quite a while. <laughs> this is our second Valentine's Day together and this year I got on something really special. I was really excited because this finally arrived. This might look familiar to some of you because this pattern is called the Rothschild pattern. And the Rothschild pattern is from the famous winemakers. It's made by Herend in Hungary. And Herend is a very famous and prestigious porcelain company. Steph's got some plates in this pattern, which she absolutely loves. Uh, we use them all the time for dinners. And she also uses them at Christie's in New York. And if you want to know more about that, I'll put the link to the video right here. And the funny thing about this candlestick is that it's not just a candlestick, because it's also made to be made <laughs> into a lamp, because it's got a hole here and a hole inside that you can stick something through like a cable. It's amazing. So I'm very excited to today be making this into a little lamp for Steph. But before I do anything else, I'm gonna give this thing a clean cause it looks like it needs it. So I gave it a good wash, a good polish, and I absolutely love the end result. It looks beautiful and shiny again. Now I'm gonna show you all the things I picked up at Brico, which is the local DIY shop. They have a little candle section, which is like just a little fake candlestick. It's this tube with a dripping design and then the actual fitting. And then there's also a little metal thing I found. I was thinking as it's got a hole in it, I would be able to screw this into that and use that to secure the candle bit to the actual candlestick. I also picked up this cable with a light switch and a European plug as we are in France. A light bulb with very dim lighting because I'm thinking that maybe we should put this on her dressing table. Um, I think it would give a nice glow and she doesn't really use a dressing table to put her makeup on, she does that in the bathroom. So it could just look very nice. Also, this is a little lampshade and it looks very dirty and disgusting right now, but I think we'll be able to salvage this because I know that Steph really likes lampshades on candlesticks. I've made the hole inside the candlestick a bit bigger so that this little rod can actually fit through. But my first step is to undo these screws and attach these wires to it through this thing. Forgive me if I don't know the technical terms for these things. Um, my grandfather told me how to do basic wiring, but I never learned the actual terms in English because I'm Dutch and English is not my first language. I need to push this through this hole and then the next hole there on the inside, like this. So that when it sits flat, because this will go inside there, is actually completely flat on the table. Push this through there, push that through here, push the actual cable through there, and then attach these wires to where the other wires used to be connected. When the wires are in place, you just tighten the screws, and the only thing left to do is to screw this bit onto that bit. Wow. And that's securely fastened. Now you would think we're almost done, and you're kind of right. The only thing is that as this actually wasn't a flat surface, but it had a hole in it and this bit doesn't fit there, I need to cut off a little bit of this white tube about to there, I'd say. So that actually covers to the right length. I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. I've marked my line. I'm going to use a saw to just take that end piece off. That went more smoothly than I thought. Well, I mean, it's not completely straight, but I can fix it with a bit of filing. I filed it down and cleaned it up, and now time for the big reveal. This should be the final step. Look at that. All right, let's put the lamp in. Voila, so let's plug it in, and fingers crossed. Look at that, it's super cute. Okay, I'm going to just quickly clean up this, and then we can look at what it looks like together. Voila. Look at that, and then final reveal. It looks beautiful. I'm really happy with it. It gives us this pink glow and it's absolutely beautiful in the room. I'm not quite sure if maybe the lampshade is just a tad too small for my liking, but it's what we had lying around and I like to repurpose things. So maybe in the future I'll change it to something slightly bigger, but it's absolutely beautiful. And I know 
hope and think Seth's gonna love it. This was just a quick little Valentine's Day video and I'm very happy to be able to share with you one of my like quite personal Valentine's Day presents for Steph. Um, I hope she'll love it. And if you like the video, please leave a like on the video because it helps out enormously with the YouTube algorithm. Subscribe if you'd like to see more videos and hit the little notification bell next to it if you want to be notified as soon as I upload a new video. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you so much for watching and see you all next time. Alright, Steph, can I just confirm that you have not seen anything yet? You've had your eyes anything. closed the entire time. Can I open them? Not quite yet. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. I love it. <laughs> oh my, I love it, I love it. Oh, it's so beautiful. I'm very pleased you like it. <laughs> no, I more than like it. It's the Rothschild birds. Mm-hmm. That is incredibly thoughtful of you. Where on earth did you find it? eBay. <laughs> I've got a search set up for all of our favorite patterns. And it's a little lamp. Well, actually, it used to be a candlestick. So you, it, it was looks a, kind of like a candlestick. It was a convertible awesome. candlestick. Yeah. So yeah. I got everything else and I found the lampshade downstairs in a little cupboard. I was just covered in cobwebs. And did you, uh, mean, you did you make the lamp? Yeah. Out of the candlestick? Well done. Thank you. No, I'm seriously impressed. Thanks. And look how it's making everything sparkle as well. <laughs> you know it's going to match something here. Well, uh, the plate's downstairs, but... The plate's, but look, look what I use every day for my hair bands. No way. Yes. I didn't know you had that. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's the slightly different birds. They're different on each one. Yes. There's several different designs. So here, the little necklaces are over in the tree behind them. Okay. You see how they're sort of pecking at them. It's also heron, right? Yeah, it yeah, it's exactly the same. So I just keep all of my little hair bands and it lives in here. So now you've got a little dressing table set. I feel very glamorous. <laughs> I think the light might be slightly too dim to do your makeup, but... No, but I don't usually do my makeup I know. anyway. Oh my goodness, I love it. I'm very happy. Happy Valentine's Day, darling. Thank you. Happy Valentine's Day.